my name is Ngobile Nunukumalo and who I would have for dinner any space any time is 100% the phenomenal Vivian Lee, the best actress of all time. Gordon Ramsay, so that I can criticize his food to his face. I invite her Nelson Mandela. Because I'm a good Mandela. Benjani. Controversial, but I think it would be Donald Trump. What he's been able to do in business and even in politics is like it's a case study. If I could invite someone to dinner, who would it be? I would invite Martha Stewart. I think she's funny, I think she's direct, and I think he'd have a hoot of a time. If I could invite someone to dinner, it would have to be, and I said this before, Denzel Washington. is he's a phenomenal guy he's diverse he's a social guy he's a great actor and he's such good company honestly I would co-host with Karabo <laughs> because she makes really really good drinks my favorite meal to share with friends and family that's a good question uh, definitely something traditional I love South African food some salmon yes, yes. mushu Oh my gosh, favorites. Like, we always have incredible childhood stories when we taste, you know, the flavors that remind us of them. My favorite meal to share with friends and family is two different meals. To share with friends is always a bride because everybody wants to put their best foot forward. You know, if there's the person who does a potato salad, they do the potato salad. The person who fries is frying. I've got a tribe at home. And my school in Makaya, they see Damas. And it used to be in one big bowl. I think Amasi is quite a speciality cuisine. That was always a special moment because you know what? We always shared, we always connected, we always got together. So, Amasi. When it comes to sharing a meal with family, I'd say Amasi, no putu, which is like, it just reminds me of my childhood and my Durban days. So, those are the two. Obviously, a beautiful honor to be with this queen. I've known her for a long time, she's an amazing artist. And of course for me, I always like to bring my little DNA to everything I touch. I'm so happy that I get to host with Taps this year. You know, he's like a quintessential gentleman, but also he's funny, he's charming, and he knows how to capture a room. But also, you know, we're here to spark conversation. For me, I'm just happy that Stella Atois trusts me again to do this. I have fun whenever I'm hosting these, and I'm grateful to be back.